Master Cylinder Inspection Inspection Points Removal Remove the master cylinder from the vehicle. First, draw the brake fluid. Because brake fluid may damage the paint, use shop towels in the surrounding area in order to protect from dripping brake fluid. Remove the reservoir tank cap and draw the brake fluid from the reservoir tank. Remove the connector of the level sensor. Disconnect the brake lines from the master cylinder. Remove the master cylinder mounting nuts and washers. Remove the master cylinder. Be careful not to spill the brake fluid. Remove the rod seal. Disassembly. Remove the reservoir seal from the reservoir tank cap. Loosen the clamps of the hoses. Disconnect the hoses from the reservoir union. Remove the hoses from the reservoir tank. Remove the circlip, which holds the secondary piston. Remove the bolt and reservoir union. Remove the grommets. Remove the stop pin of the primary piston while pushing in the secondary piston. Remove the secondary piston and the primary piston. Inspection Inspect the following items. Check that the reservoir cap is not damaged. Check that the reservoir seal is not damaged. Check that the strainer is free of dust, clogging, and breakage. Check that the reservoir tank is not damaged and cracked. Check that the reservoir union is not damaged. Check that the hoses are not damaged. Check that the clamps are not deformed. Check that the outside of the master cylinder is not damaged. Check that the inside of the master cylinder is not worn, scratched, damaged, or corroded.